Hello. In this video, I'll explain the principle of finding how many electrons are involved in the creation of X-rays. This is a very simple problem, but it's worth looking at it. So we have the voltage across the cathode and the anode, and a current is flowing like a circuit, and we have to find out how many electrons are flowing from the cathode to the anode and creating X-rays. The fundamental is that current is nothing but the flow of electron, and every electron has got a charge. So if 20 electrons are flowing from place A to place B through a wire, 20 times the charge of one electron is flowing from place A to place B. Therefore, the equation simply becomes current I is equal to number of electrons N into E, which is the charge per electron. The charge per electron is well known. That's 1.6 into 10 to the power minus 19 coulombs. And the current in our particular problem is 0.4 divided by 10 to the power 3 amperes. So putting that in the equation, we can find out the number of electrons as I divided by E. And when you do the calculation, you get 0.25 into 10 to the power 16 or 2.5 into 10 to the power 15. That many electrons are involved in the X-ray tube. Thank you.